sorry, on ham here, and a lot of people suggested that I try the uh, lead BBs for ammunition. Uh, they're technically not BBs. I, I think the shot term would be, uh, I think they're number F shot. Uh, so, I got some. They're more expensive than pellets for whatever reason. Up in this corner, I'm going to go ahead and post what the weight of the BBs are so that uh, you have a, a reference point. Let's go ahead and shoot some BBs. These are technically round balls. They're not BBs, uh, 22 caliber, although they might, they might out at 215. So for some reason, 22 uh, caliber is really 0.215. And I think what they're trying to do is they're trying to make them go down the, uh, go down the bore easier. Um, in my experience, there's just enough tension on them when they hit the rifling so that they, uh, it holds them in there. I'm going to use the same loading procedures though. So we're going to shoot them over a chronograph first. Very gentle. It's a number two brown power load over a chronograph. That's 1463. 1736. 1800 even. No reading. 1616. And 1806. Not too bad. We'll move on. my original group, group with the brown pellets and, or the brown BBs and that wasn't too bad. The uh, green power level threes. No reading. 2033. 2116. 2082s. 2012s. And 2121. 2121. So that was the green power loads, and uh, my finger is uh, with the graphite on the on the lead BBs. Finger is getting pretty pretty black, very high, and uh, not too consistent. One, two, three, four, five. Yellow power loads now. 2100. We have a high pressure sign here. Didn't extract very well. I'm not sure if that's a representative velocity. Let's see. Okay, I'm not getting any extraction here. So I'm going to go ahead and use the range rod. Okay, 1,580. Again, we have a high pressure sign. No extraction. 1580. And check my bore to make sure I don't have any uh, obstruction or anything. No, yeah, a lot of unburnt powder in there. So I don't know if the the BBs are getting the proper tension on the rifling uh, with these or not, but. Or if the if it's just got so much powder, it's pushing them down the bore maybe a little bit and lowering the pressure so much that we don't get the same velocity. Two two zero five three, a little easier on the extraction. Two thousand and eighteen. Two thousand and fifty three. Um, so uh, they're getting kind of consistent. I, 2100, uh, I don't know why I haven't gotten over 2100 uh, with the, these. There must be something at work here uh, that I, I'm not aware of. Maybe a uh, gas blow by that I wasn't getting with the, uh, with the lower power levels. I have what appears to be a one hole group, but in reality that's only one pellet that, uh, or one BB that managed to hit the target. Uh, so I do not know what's going on with the BBs and the yellow power loads. I suspect that that's just too much for them to handle and uh, they're flying apart, uh, disintegrating or going wild somehow. Uh, so that's my only guess. Uh, I'm not going to uh, be able to confirm that because that was five shots and I got 
one pellet that uh, held together, I guess. Just to give you an example, uh, there's a power level three. We'll see what kind of velocity I can get out of this one. So it's green. And I get 2108, which is uh, higher than any of the uh, yellow. So the odd thing going on there. I do not know why, but for some reason the power level, the green power levels, which are uh, lower, uh, lower powder charge than the yellows, are, are shooting at a higher velocity. 2052. So, uh, well. <clears throat> inconsistent enough that I'm going to call it on that. This is Ryan Ham. Hope you enjoyed. Bye.